Happy Blocktober Day 17. So before we begin, make sure to like and subscribe and become part of the Crazy Conspiracy Team and turn on your bell post notifications so that you'll be notified every time I drop a video. But without further more to say, let's hop right into it. So in today's video, it's going to be a requested one. Someone asked me if I could do a video about Monica and Murder C. So here it is. Thank you for requesting. You know who you are. Shout out to you. Now, Monica is really tired of people spreading lies about her on the internet. And I guess she set the record straight on what really went on with her and Murder C. So, rumor has it that Monica and ex-boyfriend C Murder started dating when she was 16 and he was 26. But there wasn't enough proof to substantiate it. Also, Monica and C Murder have both spoken about their romance and alluded to it beginning sometime in the late 90s. But we'll get back to that. There was a fan who made the mistake of posting a comment about the R&B singer and she clapped back saying, lie, not true at all, in all caps. As previously reported, Monica has been working tirelessly to get C Murder's real name, Corey Miller, out of jail. Corey Miller did post an Instagram of him and Monica, and he just captioned it, Go live your life. And so Monica revealed in an interview with Vibe back in 2002 that she met and began dating Jarvis, not Weems, when she was 16 years old. Monica told Vibe, rapper Foxy Brown introduced her and Murder C while she and Weems were on a break. She claimed that their romance was brief in a whirlwind. Monica revealed that Miller proposed to her and was by her side when she collapsed on stage in 1998. Soon after they split, Miller met and married another woman in 1999. Monica has denied rumors that she continued dating Miller when he was married, but said they remained friends. I don't know what God holds for either of us, but Corey and I will be the best of friends until the day I die, she said. So the fan that supposedly made up this rumor said he was 26 and dated her when she was 16, but y'all still support their love story. And she replied, lie not true at all. As you can see, she is too denying her relationship with an older man while she was underage. And at this point, I can't tell her that she's wrong because only she knows what really went on. But personally, I feel like she's lying and she's trying to save her image and herself and maybe even her feelings. But I mean, it was really common back then, as you can see. And Monica too is included in this bunch. Like, we went from only thinking Aaliyah went through this to finding out Brandy went through this and now Monica. I mean, tell me it wasn't common without telling me it wasn't common. <laughs> I mean, and it still goes on today and people glorify it. I feel like people really glorify it and that's why people are able to get away with it. And you know what? A lot of these artists are only out to save their tales and it's really not her fault if she does come out and say anything because she was underage. But but, I mean, who is going to come out and say that they did date an older man underage? Like, that would get them bashed, looked at sideways. It probably would have ruined her career. I don't know if it was going on back then. But, yeah, like, I personally feel like she did. I'm not too familiar with Monica or Murder C. But, personally, it's quite obvious. The picture that I showed earlier of the two that Murder C posted kind of looks like it was around 1998. Like around the time Aaliyah was out and Monica is only 40 years old so she would have probably been younger than Aaliyah and Brandy because Brandy is 42 and that's the age Aaliyah would be so she had to be exactly what they're saying she was when she was dating him. I mean you could do the math on their dates and when they started talking but this picture looks like around 1998 or it could have possibly been from 1997 but in 1997 she was 16 in 1998 she was 18. So this picture does look like it's from 1997 or 1998 and there's really no denying this picture like now I'm not saying that this picture has more than enough proof to verify that she was dating him but it's just pretty obvious they do have multiple pictures but 
I also read that Monica's relationship with her ex, rapper C Murder, remains a mystery to many. There are songs that fans believe are about her devotion to him, and she is now working with Kim Kardashian to try to get him out of prison. But anyways, they were engaged for a brief moment but split before walking down the aisle. Monica later moved on and eventually married NBA star Shannon Brown. Her and C Murder's communication has been continuous even during her marriage. Um, a lot of fans feel like her fighting for C Murder's freedom is puzzling and they question whether she's currently in a romantic relationship with him. But she said, I'm very serious about helping him to become free. And this isn't a contingency about anything pertaining to me. And I was like disappointed that the narrative ended up going that direction. Because the truth is, the goal is just simply that. So this wasn't about a relationship. This was about freedom. There was a woman alleging to be the current fiance of the rapper and was shading Monica in a recent Instagram post. See Murder's brother, rapper Mugo Master P, also made negative comments towards Monica. Master P insinuates the two had an ongoing relationship. He also hints that he believes Monica is trying to help for publicity. I could care less about who else has been in his life because right now he is property of the state of Louisiana and until that changes I don't care about anything else she says she continues explaining that the rumors or shade from others don't bother her I'm built differently I'm made different you can come for me you can throw stones but I know my purpose in his life I know my purpose in this case so as you can see, yes, yeah, she is defending him to the fullest, but it could just be because she sees him as a good friend and she wants to be there for him, given the fact that he has been there for others. So yeah, I mean, it will always be a big mystery, but I personally feel like she could have been dating him when she was 16 because it said that she was dating him around the early 90s or late 90s. I can't remember which one it was, but she still would have been young, honestly. And I I would not be surprised if every single male artist is a and they go after all the female underage stars like I mean it's just really shocking and I'm glad that the person who requested this video told me about it because I would have never known that Monica was only 16 when she dated C Murder and it's just crazy I mean I thought Aaliyah was really the only one I mean I kind of figured she wasn't but they made her relationship so big and it's probably because she was so young but still this is really wild so we have three on the list of being underage dating older men so yeah that's really really shocking we have Aaliyah, Brandy, and Monica what a coincidence and those two they were pinned against each other to basically compete and it's just crazy like everything is crazy when it comes to the industry but it's really sad that the teens get blamed for this stuff and not the parents and you would think that the media would point fingers at the parents because at the end of the day minors are under their parents the parents are the guardians and they should be getting the heat for everything and not to keep bringing Aaliyah up but poor little Aaliyah got all the blame while her mother sat chilling with no backlash at all neither did her father like it was just so unfortunate and that's probably why these young artists are scared to speak up and say something because they know that they're gonna get blamed and they're gonna get asked why they did it in the first place why they tried to be grown before you know actually becoming grown like they get questioned more than the adults the parents and it's really sad and of, of course the parents are gonna defend it or deny it have them deny it but like you know it's just really sad and that's probably why she doesn't want to say that she dated him at a young age i don't think brandy ever denied being with the morris dude but yeah this is just a shocker this is just another for the book you guys please let me know if you have any other person you want me to talk about because i definitely will if you know any other artists that were underage dating older men let me know because i definitely will do a video on it or 
if you simply just have any other videos like more Aaliyah videos that you want me to do or anything please let me know I'll talk about anything because that's what I'm here for I could care less about what people think so yeah don't be afraid to hit me up on my Instagram my Instagram is not Aaliyah black and white it is crazy conspiracy I apologize for that that is my wrongdoing but if you can't find the name Aaliyah black and white always look up crazy conspiracy because that's probably what it is so my instagram is crazy conspiracy or if i'm wrong i'll put it on the screen and my tiktok is Aliyah black and white sorry i'm so confused but my snapchat is queen clyde yeah let me know if you guys have any videos everyone's welcome but without further more to say that'll be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it please like share comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye